In this tutorial, we will see how to calculate primary and secondary full load current of single phase transformer. Let's solve this example. The problem is 100 kVA. So the rating of the transformer is given as 100 kVA. So if we convert kVA into VA, it is 100 into 10 power 3 VA. So rating is 100 into 10 power 3 VA. Next, the given data is 3300 volt bar 240 volt. That means the EMF induced in the primary E1 is equal to 3300 volt. EMF induced in the secondary E2 is equal to 240 volt. The frequency is given as 50 hertz. So F is equal to 50 hertz. The single phase transformer has 990 turns on the primary. So number of turns on the primary N1 is equal to 990. We have to calculate the number of turns on the secondary. So we have to find number of turns on the secondary and also we have to calculate the approximate value of primary and secondary full load current. So that means I1 full load, primary current, then I2 full load, secondary current. First we will find the number of turns on the secondary. We know that E2 by E1 is equal to N2 by N1. E2 is given as 240 and E1 is given as 3300 which is equal to we have to find N2. Number of turns on the primary N1 is given as 990. Substitute this. From this N2 is equal to 240 into 990 divided by 3300. 240 into 990 divided by 3300 is equal to 72. So the number of turns on the secondary N2 is equal to 72. Next we will calculate the primary and secondary full load current. Normally the transformer rating is expressed in VA volt ampere. VA rating of the transformer is same on both primary and the secondary side. On the primary side, VA rating is equal to V1 I1. On the secondary side, VA rating is equal to V2 I2. V1 is the primary terminal voltage and I1 is the primary full load current. V2 is the secondary terminal voltage. I2 is the secondary full load current. From this, we can calculate I1 full load that is a primary full load current which is equal to VA rating of the transformer divided by V1. Likewise, the secondary full load current I2 is equal to VA rating of the transformer divided by V2. For ideal transformer, E1 is equal to V1 and E2 is equal to V2. Now we will calculate primary full load current I1 which is equal to VA rating of the transformer divided by V1. So VA rating is given as 100 into 10 power 3. Substitute this value which is equal to so the VA rating is 100 into 10 power 3 divided by V1. For ideal transformer E1 is V1. So E1 is given as 3300 volt. Substitute this 3300 which is equal to 1000 divided by 33 which is equal to 30.303 amperes. So the primary full load current is equal to 30.303 ampere next we will calculate the secondary full load current i2 which is equal to va rating divided by v2 so va rating is given as 100 into 10 power 3 divided by v2 for ideal transformer e2 is v2 so v2 you can substitute 240 So we will get 10,000 divided by 24. If we divide 10,000 by 24, we will get approximately 
six seven amperes. So the secondary full load current I two full load is equal to four hundred and sixteen point six seven ampere. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe for more videos. Thank you.